first an iconic story. It's definitely fun and exciting and like it's for the whole family. It's an event to me. Every form of the arts you can imagine is in this film. And I think that's my favorite part. If you love dance, the greatest dancers, mm -hmm. if you love poetry, if you love music, singing, everything is in it. Cats, what is missing? These songs are earworms. I mean, it's like, I mean, you cannot imagine a, a, a better musical that has you know, these kinds of songs where, you know, you leave and you just can't get it out of your head. You don't know whether to hit yourself in the head or just keep singing. Just, it's completely timeless. Musical is iconic and we're reimagining it and yes. doing a fresh like version that I hope is gonna be inspiring loads of new people. This is so spectacular. Uh, and so magical and uh, yeah, like you gotta go go Absolutely. see this in the cinema. It is an event and chow down on the popcorn mm -hmm. at AMC theaters, guys. Boom. Now it is time to make the choice. Right, well that's not going to work, is it? <laughs> that's what I say to you. <laughs> yes, and I was just asking myself, you know, what would I have felt like if I was seeing the film come out and I hadn't been part of it. It's very, very special to be to be included in it again. I mean, the most seen musical in in history. I do not take it lightly, like, wow, I get to sing Memory. Very emotional and wondering like, okay, how can I tell her story or Isabella's story within the song? And then how can I keep it true to the context of the song, which everybody know it to be? So there's a lot of things to like be mindful of. I think one of the most incredible things is it's in Frankie Haywood and they, they, they found a real, a real a star out of a ballet dancer. She is utterly stunning on, on camera, to, to mesmerising to watch. It's so rare, and I think. she hadn't done a film before. I know. To, to just the amazing ensemble cast and the best dancers in the world are in this film. God, to me it was a no-brainer to sign on because it's very, very special and just everyone in all the departments from costume and makeup to the production design are just the best, you know, the best at what they do. Tonight is a magical night. All that I wanted Where I choose the cat Was to be wanted That deserves a new life. When we were preparing for cats, I would like reference to my pets growing up. We had cat school even, um, where we would uh, learn all the ins and outs about cats and just embodying the cat, you know, takes a lot. Cat school, man. Two hours a day. That was no joke. Mm. But it was fascinating. <laughs> Even though there's brand new technology that creates fur all over our bodies, all of the movement is all real and all performed live. So there's a moment in the film where, and lots of people will think, you know, they've used it, they've used CGI to do it. Where you put your leg up, what was behind your head? I did. I did. Yeah. In that basket. I couldn't believe it. Ian McKellen, yes. Well, I lay in a cat basket all day, watching Ian McKellen, my old friend, do his number, which was bliss. And then at the end, I just thought I would have to show that I'm pleased somehow. I don't know how my leg got up there, but it seemed to. No spit, it was amazing. God, we'd learn things like cats walk with their same leg and arm, whereas normally as humans, we walk with the opposite, but cats do the same arm and leg as they walk. And like their smell is their strongest sense. And so they smell everything and, and that's what directs the movement of their head when they smell things. The sets were enormous, so we would have to jump off like big things sometimes and make it look, mm -hmm. what I would, yeah, make it look very easy. Beautiful.